Greetings everyone, it is Isla from the MESBG Nerds YouTube channel. In between battle reports, I wanted to start bringing you guys some army showcases. Considering the main amount of my time is hobby time and not gaming time, I thought it would be a waste not to. Today I've got my 800 point Numenorian army, which I am very keen to show off to you all. I am very proud of how it's come out and it's my most recently completed project. So I was thinking maybe I might start working backwards and showing you guys more projects over the time that we have together. So now here's my Lendl the Tall conversion. As you can see, um, it's quite tricky to get your hands on any mounted Lendl the Talls these days. But I've converted him from a King LSR model with a head swap and a Numenorean shield added. And next to him, we've got his dismount there as well. And his warband consists of five Numenorean bowmen and nine Numenoreans with spear and shield and a Numenorean banner bearer who's been converted from a Blackroot Veil archer, which works just perfectly. And he's just got a head swap. I can't claim credit for this conversion. I did buy this army off a friend and I've added to it with a few extra medals because I didn't really like the plastics. I think a lot of people would agree with me on that one. And this next warband is a captain who's got the red cloak, so he stands out. And then two swordsmen, which have had hand swaps with the plastic Numenorean warriors from the last alliance box. And then a banner who's been converted again from a Blackroot Veil archer, and two spearmen to help support. Coming on to Isildur's warband, and as you can see, Isildur's also mounted. This is the Isildur model, so very lucky to have my hands on that, and very lucky my friend was able to sell me that as well with the rest of the army. And he's got the same as Elendil's, so the nine spears, the banner with the spear, and five more archers. So here you can see the army in its fullest. Back to Orlando, back to a sealed door. Overall, I've had two games with this army, and that was before Orlando and a sealed door. Um, I had the mounts built up for them, so I'm very excited to have another game to see how they go. Both games went very well for the Numenorians. I've thoroughly enjoyed playing them. I think the warriors have absolutely fantastic statistics and the heroes are absolutely amazing. And if you want to see more content like this and you'd like to see a battle report with the Numenorians facing off against a foe, who knows, maybe one of Justin's army armies and um, maybe we have something planned in the future, maybe something along the lines of a battle of Daggle Lad esque scenario with lots of evil orcs and plenty of elves and Numenorians allied together. Anyway, thank you for watching. Like and subscribe if you enjoyed the video, and I shall see you in the next one.